to do the pineapple stitch, you're going to start with a chain where the number of chains is a multiple of two. I'm going to do eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Once you have your multiple of two, you will then add four more stitches. So one, two, three, and four. And that one is ready to begin. To begin row one, we're going to skip the first three chains and start in the fourth chain from the hook. And we'll begin with our first pineapple stitch. So you're going to yarn over, insert your hook, draw up a loop. And you're going to yarn over again, insert your hook, grab your yarn, bring up a loop. So we've done that two times so far. We're going to do it two more times. So yarn over, insert your hook, bring up your loop. And we're doing this all into that same stitch. I'm going to do it one more time and bring up our loop. So that should give us one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine loops on our hook. Now you're going to grab your yarn and you're going to pull through the first eight loops. So once you get through, don't pull through that last loop, only the first eight. Now you're going to grab your yarn and then pull through the two loops that are on your hook. And that is your pineapple stitch. Before moving on to the next stitch, you're going to yarn over and chain one. Now we will skip the next stitch and do another pineapple. So you yarn over, insert your hook, bring up your loop. That's once. Yarn over into the same stitch, bring up your loop. That's two. Yarn over, insert hook, bring up your loop. That's three. Yarn over, insert hook, bring up your loop, and that's four. And we should have nine loops on one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. Yep, nine loops. Grab your yarn, pull through the first eight loops. Make sure you're going through all of those. Do not go through that last loop because now you're going to grab your yarn, pull through these two. Chain one, skip the next stitch and do another pineapple. And you'll just keep repeating this for the remainder of your row. There's two, three, and four. Grab the yarn, pull through the first eight, and then grab the yarn, pull through two, chain one. Skip the next stitch and do another pineapple. There's one, two, three, and four. Pull through all of those, leaving that last one there. Pull through those two, and then chain one. Now that I've come to the end of my row, I'm going to skip one stitch and do one last pineapple stitch into this last stitch. There's one, two, three, and four. Grab the yarn, pull through the first eight, 
Grab the yarn, pull through two. That completes the pineapple stitch. And now we'll chain three. One, two, and three, and turn. So there is row one of the pineapple stitch. For row two, you're going to put one pineapple into each space between the previous pineapples. So you'll yarn over, insert your hook in that space between, bring up your loop, yarn over, that's two, three, and four. That should have nine loops on my hook. Pull through the first eight. Grab the yarn. Pull through those last two. And there is our pineapple. We're not going to chain on this row. So you'll move directly to the next space. Yarn over and do another pineapple. There's one, two, three, and four. Make sure you're getting through each of those loops. Grab your yarn, pull through the final two. And moving on to the next space. One, two, three, and four. Pull through. There we go. Grab the yarn, pull through the last two. And another space here. So one, two, three, four, grab the yarn, pull through the first eight. Oh, I thought I was going to make it all the way through in one swoop. Nope, not this time. Grab the yarn, pull through those last two loops. Once you've reached the end of your row, you'll have this chain space here. You're going to do another pineapple into that chain space. So one, two, three, and four. Pull through the first eight. Grab the yarn. Pull through the last two. And now you will chain three. One, two, and three. And then turn your work. From this point on, you will repeat row two until you've reached the length that you're looking for. So you'll do one pineapple stitch, one pineapple stitch in between each of your other ones from the previous row. When you've reached the end of your row, you'll do one final pineapple stitch in this chain space. Chain three, turn your work and repeat.